Hey, what's up guys? My name's Tim from Dangerous Sweet, and welcome back to the forest. So, if you notice, we're not where we were when we left off the last episode, and that's because I recorded an episode, and it didn't go so well. My computer crashed, and I was rather heartbroken. That was a skull, by the way. I wasn't surprised, because I was surprised the first time that I did this. So, yeah, and there's a dead body here on the bed too, which is strange. So halfway through the episode that I tried to record last night, I saved here on the boat because this episode was supposed to be about the boat. It's not that bad because there's not really a whole lot going on here on the boat. I did find the cassette player and the cassettes and there's some rope up here and what I th I can't carry more rope bastard always need rope I do have that turtle shell oh I do have my club that's good okay and I do have the cassette player okay so what I think crashed the game I got way off track there for a second what I think crashed the game was when I tried to use the cassette player I tried to listen to one of the tapes. I tried to listen to tape one, and it played for about 10 seconds, and the computer just crashed. Not the game. My computer crashed. Everything was gone. So, yeah, there's not a whole lot on the boat, which, okay, fine. We have the cassette player. I'm not going to use the cassette player, and anybody out there playing, don't use the cassette player. I don't know that that's what crashed it, for sure. Because I did have some stuff going in the background. But I believe that's what it was. And belief is a powerful tool. What is very unfortunate... Okay, I have my feathers. Awesome. Yeah, I got a ton of feathers. While I was recording last night. Oh, you bastard. Here. And now we got a couple more. And I can't carry the meat. Fine. The seagull head. Don't need that. What is extremely heartbreaking is I ran into a couple of the uh, islanders. I don't know what they're called. Is it in the book, actually? Just. Okay, that's a bestiary, but. It doesn't really call them anything. I'm just going to call them Islanders for right now. I ran into a couple. Got into a tussle. Because that's a word. And I killed them. And I did what I refer to as bone farming. And that involves chopping them into pieces. Kind of like that. And burning their limbs until all the skin falls off and you're left with bone and I did that and I made some bone arrows and it was awesome and I did that right here where this fire is and I don't have that bone now because the game crashed but we're going to carry on so for this video I think we're gonna go find us some islanders Natives. That's a better word. We'll go with natives. Because I want bone now. Also in that video that nobody will ever see because it doesn't exist anymore. I mentioned that I started a second save file. Because I wanted to mess around and kind of learn the, ga learn the game a little bit better without worrying about recording the whole time. My mouse got away from me there. Ooh. That looks important. I wish there was a map, and I wish there was a way to mark this. Ooh, there is a way to mark this. I'm going to make a house. But before I get sidetracked, yeah, I made another save file so I could kind of mess around and learn the game a little bit more. And I've gotten a little bit braver since. 
and I'm not so afraid to run up on an enemy and beat the crap out of them with my plane axe. And I did just that, and it went quite well. And then my game crashed. Okay, so I just built a little hunting shelter. And the whole purpose of that was so I have a marker to where this is. So I can make my way back. Because that's something I definitely want to explore. Pick up some more seeds, just because I can. And it is getting dark now. Oh, and that little village is right over there. Well, just because I'm braver now doesn't mean I want to fight him in the freaking pitch black. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and go back to camp for right now. And I think we're going to go ahead and do this tunnel, actually. I wanted to find some of the natives and mess around with them. But it's getting dark anyway. I'm kind of right here in their territory. So we're going to hold off on that. There might even be some of them down there. I don't know. Alright. Deadfall Trap is still doing good. A little deer hanging out. Got my water going here. And I have the stuff for another water collector. So we're going to go ahead and make another water collector also. Because that was something that I read. Here we go. I got lost. Um, yeah, something that I read was it's good to have a couple of water collectors. But you can only carry one turtle shell at a time. So, at some point, I'm going to go get another turtle shell. Actually, I'm just going to keep making water collectors, really. Um, the more I have, the better, I figure. And... Okay, that bat... I had some meat that had gone bad. I think that's one, actually. I don't know if it would give me anything or not. Nope. Alright, do I have any to cook? Yes, I do. Well, that's what we'll do then. I'm screaming out in the distance. That's no big deal. Come on, I didn't want to drink that. Either I just don't know the controls very well, or they need to change them up a little bit. See, I can't tell if that's a deer making noise or if that was a woman screaming. It sounded more like a woman screaming. Okay, dinner's up. Get ourselves a nice little meal there. The hell? What'd you go and do that for? That was stupid. I've gone camping plenty of times. I have never once had my campfire fall apart. Not one time. There. Stay there and do your job. Okay, so I think that's going to do it for tonight. I'm going to go ahead and save, sleep until morning, and I'll see you guys then. Alright guys, it is morning time. All is calm and right with the world. Well, I wouldn't go that far. I'm just going to eat a couple of energy bars here. Stop equipping it. I just want to drink. There. Bastard. I know the water's bad. Suck it up, bitch. Okay, so we have two options here. We can either 
check out that little village. Mess around with this lizard. Oh. Come on, little lizard dude. Ah, thank you. Your sacrifice is duly noted. There we go. And where? Nice. Oh, that's pretty cool looking. Okay, so we can mess around with the village. See if we find anybody over here. Or we can go down the hole. I've never gone down the hole, so I don't know what to expect. Oh, there's already pe Oh, there's three people. Dare I? Dare I? No, oh, back up, man. Oh, crap, there's four of them. And they're trying to surround me. Back up. growling at me. Where'd that fourth one go? Man, get out of here. You best step back. Get an arrow in the face, see? You want another? Get back. I don't care if you're wearing skulls on your head. Don't bother me none. lead you all over my deadfall trap if I have to. Where's my club? I will beat you to death with a skull in the hand. Come on, motherfuckers. Let's do this. You already got an arrow in the face. You're a bad motherfucker. I'll give you that. Be running around with an arrow in your brain. So are we just gonna dance or what? Come on, guys. Oh, there's one. Come on, guys, what you wanna do? Take my arrow back, thank you very much. A couple of sticks here. Now, where'd the big guy go? Not really liking that he disappeared. You know what I mean? If he went to get friends, I feel like I'm gonna regret every decision I've made thus far. Okay, so, well, the cool part, hey, buddy, why is he circling me? Stop it. What are you doing? You bastard, we get out of here. Okay, so what we're about to do is what I tried to do last time, or what I did do last time, I just didn't, it just didn't record right is I am finally going to get some bone. And I don't want to do this at my base just because I don't want body parts laying around, I guess. So, yeah, this is exactly what you think it is. I won't make you guys sit through the whole thing. It's gruesome. We'll be back in a minute. Okay, so we got a couple of limbs. Throw the arms on, throw the legs on, and then those just uh, cook. And we wait for them to do their thing while we chop up the other one. You can only carry two of each at a time. Uh, either the lizard just ran into my fire. Well, okay. I mean, I appreciate the help, I suppose. Okay, and here, Shortwood, we'll have a few bone. And we can do pretty cool things with bone. That, er, that feather is not coming back. There we go. I forgot to mention that eating the limbs is also a thing. I haven't done it because I don't know what it'll do to you. 
I have no plans of doing it. I am going to cook some actual meat, though. Dude's getting hungry. Oh, and I'm going to take their heads, too. Because I'm going to make my own effigy. Can I not carry another? I've got a couple of skulls in one head. Okay. Maybe that's all I can carry. Wait for my actual meal to cook. Can't carry another bird. But I can always take feathers. Okay, there we go. Go ahead and put the fire out. Just like that. And we'll leave those there. Because, yeah, we don't need those. And I'm thinking a good spot. Let's do it right here. Open this up. What are these? Oh, okay, yeah, I picked those up earlier. Okay, and here's effigies. There's a custom effigy. And that's what we're going to use. We're going to put that there. And we're going to take the head. We're going to add it. That's not how I wanted to rotate that, but thanks for the attempt, I suppose. And there we go. And hopefully that will serve as a warning. Be like, hey, guys, back off. Okay, so now that we've taken out a couple of those guys, Let's get a little closer to that village there. And I don't know what will happen if I start tearing down their effigies. I don't know what that will do. If you guys know, tell me. And if it's not too detrimental, I'll start doing it. Otherwise, I'm going to wait and try it on my other save file. Because that's not something that I want to mess up. Okay, so the village should be right over here. Yeah, I see one of the effigies now. Actually, we've made a fair bit of progress because we got our bone now. So, I'm going to go ahead and make my arrows. Okay, so bone arrows are one stick, five feathers, and five bone. And there we go. And what I thought was really cool, let's equip the bow real quick, is how you change arrows. Oh, bird, okay. All you do is you look down, and then you hit R. And you can cycle between your two, your two arrows. I thought that was really cool. So we've got some decent ooh I can I can upgrade my spear now upgraded spear three bones and two cloth I have just enough nice okay well I'm going to save and then we'll go check out the village okay I think we're ready to go I'm going to equip my good arrows. Because I don't really need them for hunting. We seem to do okay. Just going to kind of sneak my way in over here. If things get too crazy, I can always go running for the water too. Oh, they've got water right over here. I'm going to 
gonna fill up my pot while I'm here. There we go. Well, it seems quiet enough right now. And the geese are mad, but the geese are always mad. I've never seen a goose in a good mood. Oh man, that's a lookout? Cool. No. Stop swinging your axe around the lookout. Okay, so I assume they eat people. I don't know why that one... That's an interesting texture right there. See that one glistening? What can I hit with this? Bird. There's a body right there. Ooh, lizard. Let's throw the ball out of lizard. Oh, I don't get a throw marker with those. Never noticed that. Can I light this? Nobody can take that pot. Or I could take that pot. If I didn't already have one. Kind of wish I could carry more mids too. Got a soda though. Okay, well that looks like something that I can probably blow up with an explosive. So I'll have to keep that in mind. It probably leads to the same place that uh, that other tunnel goes. So there's really not a whole lot going on here it looks like. I do want to climb up here real quick. Might not be the best idea in lightning, but that's okay. I definitely do want to throw the tennis ball from up here. Let's see how far I can get it. Yeah. Yeah, cool. I don't know if that's a popping texture or if that was somebody's light. It seems to have stopped now though, so... That was probably just a texture popping in and out, I think. Okay, well let's go ahead and get down. Well, at least we can say we checked the village out, even if there's not a whole lot here. We did find another entrance to, a, to the tunnel. I assume it's the same tunnel. That only makes sense. Why that one's covered up, I don't know. And it's pouring down rain, so we better get back. Actually, I'm better off to stay in here, I think. Oh, I can't sleep yet. Well, damn. Guess we better walk back then. You're cold and wet. Build a fire to get dry. Well, yeah, that's what I'm trying to do. I'm going to light this bitch up. There we go. Throw a nice deer steak on for dinner. Oh, I'm getting cold. Can I sleep yet? Nope. Okay, well, I'm going to go ahead and end this episode here, because all I'm going to do is sleep and then start the next day as soon as I can. So, next episode, I think we're going to be going down into the cave. So, oh, also, again, if you guys know what tearing down their effigies does, let me know. I would greatly appreciate that. So, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, hit that like button, and I'll see you guys next time. Later, guys.